Hey everyone, welcome to the channel. Happy New Year. JDog FPV here. Today we're going to talk about why I have four motors that spin on one shot 125, but as soon as I go to D shot 300 or 600, I have one motor that it won't spin. Um, for me, it's motor four. Um, it may be a different motor for you, but I have three motors that spin on D shot protocol and then one that doesn't. But as soon as I go to one shot 125, all motor spin just fine. So, um, without further ado, let's go on to beta flight, um, show what I'm experiencing, and then a possible fix that might help you out that I found. So, uh, let's jump on to beta flight. All right, I'm gonna plug the drone in. I'm gonna jump on the beta flight up here. Content. All right, so go to configuration here. D shot six hundred right now. It's on. So I'm on it. So with this protocol right now, if I jump to motor tab. Bear with me as I plug a battery in. All right. So, as you can see, motor 4 does not spin, but every other motor does, and rather smoothly, but for whatever reason, that motor 4 will not work, so uh, I'm just going to unplug it or stop it. <clears throat> And then if I go to one shot, 125, and say it and reboot. Make sure it's saved. It did. Um, you'll see that all four motors spin just fine. Which, if you want, one shot one two five is still not a bad protocol. But if you want the RPM filtering, definitely run D shot. That's your only option. Um, so for me, I really want D shot protocol. So um, what I found was it doesn't matter which configurator you use, but it does matter which flight controller software you use. And right now, the software that I'm using is where it tells you up at the top to 4.2.10 or version will tell you to if in the CLI. What I found was you have to run 4.2.9 and that fixes the issue. So I'm going to download firmware. I'll put this link in the description if you have the same flight controller. Um, I'll leave this right there. Firmwares. And then slightly this up top here, you want this 4.2.9 or 4.2.8 works as well. Um, anything besides 4.2.10, um, that one they have an issue with. So don't choose a 4.2.10 if you want DSHOP protocol. So I'm going to go back to, I don't know why I closed out beta flight. Alright, so, update firmware flash here. And let that load. I'm going to go to load firmware local. And then I'm going to download 4.2.9. There it is right there. kind of hard doing both at the same time but um, should be good it's flashing okay, there we go connect so, 
um, yeah, as soon as I flash that firmware, it's, uh, this is disabled, but go ahead and try DShot 600, save and reboot. Go back to your motors tab. I had to unplug my drone because I got an air unit and those get super hot really fast. So. Okay, so it's plugged in. And now, voila! A oh, four motor spin. And just out of curiosity, they are spinning. And one spinning the wrong way. Two are spinning the wrong way. I'll fix that later. But um, if you'd like to see a video on how to change the motor direction, let me know. Um, super easy process. I'll make a video on that if you're interested. Um, but there you have it. Just change to 4.28, 4.29 with this firmware or something older you should have no issues with D shot protocol just avoid using the 4.210 um, another side note I would like to point out if you would like a custom drone by Mitten Visuals this is a little company I'm starting um, do photography videography but on the side I do custom drone building so if interested, uh, you can email me at jacobwestlake at mittenvisuals.com and I will get a custom drone of your choice up and going. Um, just let me know which you want. This is a custom build that I just did. Really love it. I could do analog or digital. doesn't matter. I've been building for a few years. So um, and it doesn't matter which size you want. can't really see those, but those are 10-inch drones. But do center lifters, you name it you dream it i can build it so let me know hope this video helped um like subscribe and i'll see you next time i'm gonna try to post a video every friday this year so um once a week plan on a new video coming out every friday all right take care